Okay, in order to access your cameras, you're going to go ahead and click on the upper left menu button and you're going to select Cloud P2P. And it should be automatically logged in. So you're going to select the device, which is your 16 channel DVR recorder at your location. You click on that. And then on the bottom, you're going to go ahead and click Live View. And depending where you're at, there might be a delay. That's normal with the reception. And you only have two, two bars <laughs> with, with Verizon here. At reception. So all the cameras are loading up. So it does that, if it doesn't load a camera, just hit it again and it will load. And if it doesn't load, it's because of the bandwidth. And right here you only have two bars of signal strength. So if it has full bars, it'll be able to connect. See, that one did connect. So now it's gonna connect. And the thing is you're using two IP cameras, so they will not come up here, but you just swipe to the, you, you swipe to the right. Yes. Like that. You swipe to the right and you'll be able to access. Yeah, right now let it load up because it's continued to load. And I think because we added those cameras, I have to add them to the to the list. So let me uh, down arrow. And there it is. It's because they're not enabled. You see those two cameras, 17 and 18? Those are your IP cameras. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and load them up no just one time this is just one time because I'm, I'm setting up so now that it has that now you can swipe and the two front cameras will come on but say if you're connected on Wi-Fi it'll connect right away instantly like save your home and you see the camera and there's the two cameras in the front it's because they're IP cameras, so they don't use they don't use the uh, this these channels. They use another page, so that's normal. So on that part, let me just show again. You go ahead and click the menu button, go Cloud P2P, and you'll see your device. You click the device, and then you're gonna hit Live View, and it will connect on it will connect all the cameras. So that will show you how to connect to your cameras. So I'll end the video right there so you know that part.